A recap on folic acid dose in pregnancy. Why do we take folic acid to reduce the risk of neural tube defects? Now, most people are going to be taking 400 micrograms once a day until the 12th week of pregnancy, unless you're considered at higher risk of neural tube defect, in which case you take the higher dose of five milligrams once a day, again, until 12 weeks of pregnancy. What are the reasons why you consider to be higher risk of having an NTD? Number one, if you've got a personal history of it yourself in the past, if you've got a partner who's got a history of an NTD, or if you've got anyone in the family or family history of neural tube defects, you're considered at higher risk. Secondly, if you take an anti-epileptic medication, Thirdly, if you have celiac disease. Fourthly, if you have diabetes. Fifthly, if you have a BMI of 30 or more. And finally, if you've got a history of either sickle cell or thalassemia. Now remember, normally you take it until 12 weeks for all of them except for sickle cell and thalassemia, where you should take your five milligrams right until the point of delivery. So usually, folic acid is 400 micrograms once a day until 12 weeks. The higher dose is five milligrams. Various situations and reasons why you might need this dose. Have a look at CKS preconception advice for further details. Hope this helps.